everyone, it's Misty here. Thanks so much for joining me today. So in today's video, I am doing what I'm calling an A to Z. Hi there everyone, it's Misty here. Thanks so much for joining me. Hi there everyone, it's Misty here. Thank you so much for joining me today. In today's video, I am doing what I am calling a refresh of my project Beauty A to Z. If you are new to me or new to my channel, welcome, I appreciate you. So I am a project painter, which just means I'm trying to use um, my collection, <laughs> my collection of makeup and beauty, hair care and skin care. And this project was created by the fantastic ladies. All of the information will be linked down below but you basically choose an item that corresponds to your alphabet. Since I'm an English speaker, I used the English alphabet, which was A to Z. And as of last update, which was just last week, <laughs> I've used 19 products. So I've been talking about in the last couple of updates that maybe I would add some things in. And a couple of you chimed in and said that you would love to see that. So that's actually what I've done. So I'm adding in a new product for every letter I finished minus Z because it was hard enough to find Z to begin with. I dang sure can't find a Z right now. <laughs> so I'm gonna walk you through all of the products that I have. If I took weights, I will throw up a picture um, and then I'll tell you what my goal is. So yeah, if you, so the next time you see a Beauty A to Z update will be at the 1st of July. I will update you on my progress on these as well. And the reason why I'm doing this is because I don't want to wait an entire month to start using these products when I can go ahead and start using them now. And some of them I have been using. So let's start with A. I am bringing in the Angel Nova perfume by Mugler. I don't know. I've never had any of their perfumes before. So this is just a perfume sample. It's brand new. Goal is to finish that. For the letter B, I have the Beekman 1802. They're better beta retinol serum um this is starting its life at 133 i have been using this i add a couple of drops of this to my elf holy hydration at night i'm really enjoying this i don't know why i didn't put this in my 50 shades of purple um, probably because i got it afterwards but um, i'm loving it and i'm gonna get some pretty good use out of it oh i can finally mark this okay <laughs> i'm marking this i weighed it for the letter C, I have the Philosophy Lemon Custard. Um, this is the Shampoo, Shower, Dry, Body Wash, Bath, Bath, whatever it's called. Um, this I use as a shower gel. This weighs 313 grams, but you can see where I'm starting at. My goal is to finish this. I don't love, I don't love this scent. Um, I am on the hunt for the perfect lemon scent, and I don't think I'm ever going to find it. But um, I do enjoy the philosophy formula, but um, yeah, so my goal is to finish this. Hopefully I will finish it before the end of summer. Um, that way I don't have to carry this into fall because this definitely to me is a summer scent. For the letter D, I'm doing my Daisy Rollerball. I need to mark this too. Hold up, wait a minute. So this is... <laughs> this is the original Mark, da Mark Daisy, Mark Jacobs um, perfume. Are they, is he going to stop making perfume or is it just makeup? Oh Lord. Um, this is starting its life at 21 grams. I love, I love the scent of this. Um, yeah, I may have to pick up another one. This is the one that has the um, kind of round top with the white daisies all over it. I love it, love it, love it. Daisy Dream is what it's called. So my goal is to finish this. And I'm giving myself until the end of the year, which is when this project ends. Um, e I'm already working on. F is the new Pharmacy Green Clean. This is brand new. I haven't even... Oh, oh no, I just lost the sponge. It's brand new. I haven't even opened it yet. I'm currently working on one from Good Molecules and my Fifty Shades of Purple. So once that is done, I will move on to this. Spoiler alert, I prefer this one, but I'm going to finish the other one because I've already started it. So yeah, this one is starting its life at 143 grams. But again, I probably won't start this until the other one is finished. 
for the letter G, I'm bringing in this Go Big or Go Home Mascara from Kat Von D. This is brand new and it is starting at 10 grams. It's just a small little sample. I got this huge bag from Ulta of samples. <laughs> so it's like, I'm saving most of them. I hope to do an advent calendar pro or advent project pin starting in January. But I thought, okay, let me pull out some to use right now. So I'm gonna, my goal is to finish this. I have, I have a couple of other ones that I need to start before this one, so we'll see. Um, but yeah, so this one, 10 grams, and yeah. For the letter H, I'm doing my pharmacy. Oh, I knew I marked this wrong. <laughs> I did my pharmacy. You know what? We're not even gonna worry about marking because I'll wait it. This is the Pharmacy Honeymoon Glow. This is their exfoliating serum, which is my, I hate to say holy grail because that's so old, but it's my holy grail. Like this is the one that I absolutely love. Um, it stinks to high heaven, but I use this now about once a week. And the next morning, my face is just so smooth. It removes all of the dead skin cells. I absolutely love it. I would recommend grabbing it at Black Friday. I think it was 30% off. Um, so yeah, I, I really, really love this. This will definitely be a repurchase. And my goal is to finish this. It weighs, um, I think that says 93. <laughs> we'll see. But yeah, so I marked it incorrectly. But um, yeah, I love it. But before I was using it like twice a week, but now I feel like I can get it away with just once. My tell for me is I think it's this, I think it's this side. I get a patch right here on my forehead that um, lets me know that it's time. It's time to exfoliate. So that's for the letter H. Am I recording? Yes, I am recording. <laughs> that would suck. For M, I am bringing in the Marula and Jasmine Shea Sugar Grub Scrub from Tree Hut. Um, I've mentioned before, I actually put these into four ounce containers about the size of this and then keep them in my bathroom. I'm currently working on one in my 50 Shades Purple again. So this won't get any use just yet, but my goal is gonna to be to finish it. N is, no. H, oh, that was J, I apologize. <laughs> H, I already have a project. This was J for the Jasmine. K is the, Royal Honey and Kalahari Desert Melon Hair Mask from um, Not Your Mother's. This is just a hair mask. And I actually bought the hair mask so I could smell the, um, smell the product to decide if I wanted to purchase the big, um, like their big, what am I trying to say, products. Um, because I bought this like at the beginning of last year, like right when COVID had hit, no one was being able to go in store. So I went ahead and ordered this. So my goal is gonna be to use this up. L, I'm already working on M. M is the Milani concealer. <laughs> so this is the Conceal Imperfect Concealer Palette. I don't even know if they make this anymore, but this was available before they came out with their Conceal Imperfect um, Wand Concealer. So <laughs> this weighs 48 um, grams. My goal right now is to finish this shade right here. This is a pink corrector. Um, I may move on to the other three, but definitely working on this one. So my goal is to finish this. We'll see how far I get, um, but yeah. So I just started using this. I used it for the first time today. I enjoy it, so yeah. This is one of the makeup products. So I have two makeup products so far. And N is this. This is the butt naked. <laughs> this is a whipped body booker. I honestly, I have no idea what the notes of this are supposed to be. But if you follow my Partners in Cream Project Pan, I'm also using a lemon drop one in that. So my goal is gonna be to finish this. This is so good. Um, I wish her scents were a little easier to understand because I really love this formula. If you're someone who is oily, this is not gonna work for you. If you're someone who's really, really dry like me, this is perfection. Um, it's basically whipped oils. So it melts in your fingers and you rub it in and I love putting it on at night. It smells so good and I'm able to just wake up refreshed and hydrated and my KP has basically gone away since I started using um, a body butter and a body scrub. So this is for N. O is my Ola Henriksen uh, Banana Bright 
eye cream. So this is brand new. I haven't used it yet. You can see what it looks like. I'm currently finishing a Neutrogena one and I've in my past update, in my last update, you saw that I finished using the Sea Beauty one. Not the Sea Beauty. Juice Beauty. <laughs> so when that one is finished, when the Neutrogena one is finished, I will move on to this. My goal is going to be to finish it. I have a feeling this will probably last till the end of the year. We'll see how far we get. Oh, P is the passion fruit kombucha and awapu ginger hair mask. I actually had that in this, <laughs> a philosophy amazing grace lotion thing. So you can see how much I have. This currently weighs 55 grams. Once this is finished, I'm gonna put that other mask in here. Um, I don't use this every time I shower. I probably use it once a week. Um, it smells good. It works okay. It's not anything that I would write home about. And I don't I only have hair mask again because I wanted to smell it. <laughs> and that was the inexpensive way to do it. So yeah, goal is to finish that. P Q. Q is the Clinique Take the Day Off Makeup Remover. This is brand new. This is another sample that I picked up from Ulta or I got from Ulta. This is 38 grams. My goal is going to be to finish this. I was using the Body Shop Chamomile one. I don't feel like that takes off anything. So I will probably use this for my eye makeup. Uh, like today I have on this really pretty glitter from Vanny Cosmetics. Um, I like to use a waterproof makeup remover on my eyes because I wear waterproof mascara. Anyway, it's a thing. And that um, Good Molecules, <laughs> It doesn't take off anything. It doesn't remove my eye makeup at all. So yeah. So anyway, my goal is to finish that. And that is for the letter Q. V is this. This is a Virtue, Virtue Alpha Keratin Scrub. This was a free gift from Ulta. Um, it's a scalp scrub, you guys. <laughs> this reminds me, I think it's Jupe. A men's cologne. It smells. It smells so good. Like, I'm gonna look them up and see if they make like shampoo and conditioner because I would love this scent. Oh, it smells so good. So this is a scalp scrub and my goal is to use it up. VWW -W is the Tree Hut Watermelon Body Butter. This is their whipped body butter. I love this formula too. This scent is so good. Um, you guys have heard me rave on and on and on about how well Ulta does watermelon. Tree Hut's done watermelon well, really, really well too. This is the body butter. Also have the body scrub. Sorry. Oh, it just smells so good. I love like watermelon. So I'm diabetic. You guys probably know that. And I, I do low carb and watermelon is probably the one thing I miss. If I'm having a cheat day and it's the summer, I'm asking Rob to bring home watermelon and I'm eating it with some salt on it because I just love it so much. Mm, it smells so good. So my goal is going to be to finish this. Um, this will get used before that butt naked gets used because to me this is more of a like a summery scent and that's more of a it can transition from summer to fall so yeah goal is to finish this one this big bad boy weighs 302 grams I believe and then last but not least no we have two more X is this bear with me um prime set and refresh from NYX I had this in my 50 shades of pink last year and then I abandoned that project. So we are starting here. Um, I use this as a spray after I wash my face, um, before I put on my tone, like that um, eye unique toner. I spray my face with this and another spray um, to just kind of wet my face again so it will, will, it will absorb. So my goal is to finish these. And then last but not least, is this Glam Glow Youth Mud for the letter Y. Um, this is a glow stimulating treatment. Youth Mud. It's a mask and it's a packet. So my goal is of course going to be to finish that. So <laughs> if I'm able to finish all of these, this will be a very successful project for me. Um, and I know now that even though I don't wear makeup very often, that I could probably get away with putting a little bit more makeup in next year's Beauty A to Z. This is definitely one I want to do again. So that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate you. Um, I will have my playlist linked at the end of the, um, on the end slate where you can find my other videos as well. Um, if you want to subscribe, 
please feel free. <laughs> you can follow me on Instagram. Um, I don't post often enough on Instagram. I need, listen, I have four channels, okay? I'm about, no, I have three channels. I'm about to start a fourth channel and a booktube channel. And so I'm really bad at Instagram. I've always been really bad at Instagram. So I'll try to get better, but I'm not making any promises, but you can follow me there if you want to. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. I love your faces and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.